Hello, my fellow book lovers. My name is Mark Moiser, and this is Bookmark Lessons from History. Hey, today I want to talk to you about a book that I just finished reading. It's by Henry Ford called My Life and Work. Now, in this book, Henry Ford lays out his philosophy of doing business. His philosophy overlaid with what was going on in the United States at that time and what was going on in automobile technology. Henry Ford was not some rich man. He was a tinkerer, somebody who loved mechanics. And he fell in love with the concept of the automobile. And he created an automobile. But rather than build a car for the rich, he wanted to build a car that everyone could own. In this book, Henry Ford lays out his philosophy of doing business. This book is a history. It's a history of America moving from the country into the cities. It is a history of America moving from being farmers to manufacturers. This is a story of a man taking a rich man's toy and turning it into a necessity that all Americans love and use. Henry Ford was a disruptor. He disrupted the philosophy of making automobiles, changing it from being the toy of the rich to the necessity. He was a disruptor because he paid his workers above the minimum wage. He paid them above and beyond what was expected of him. And he created loyalty in his workers. He was a disruptor. Instead of taking just one person working on a car out of all different parts, he turned it into an assembly line so that they could produce more cars faster. In this book, you don't only learn about the building of the automobile, but how he takes his philosophy into other lines of business. He was asked to purchase a railroad, and he turned that railroad by applying his philosophies of business into that railroad. This is an important book to read if you are in business or you want to be in business. This is an important book if you want to try to understand the turning of the century and the moving from an agriculture society to a much more urban society that we see ourselves in today. If you want to understand the past, this is a great book to read. This is Bookmark and Lessons from History.